Yeah, so some early rain expected to turn to snow as it has already in Lemonster, Massachusetts. You can see that over there, those flakes falling in the headlights as the car travels on the highway over there. 12 News reporter Kate Walsh continuing our pinpoint weather team coverage live from North Smithfield. Kate, are we seeing any flakes out there yet? Well, guys, in the last half hour, it really has turned into sleet now that we're seeing. I don't know if you can see it off my jacket, but the accumulation is uh, not really happening yet. It's just we can see all of these little drops bouncing off of my jacket. It's turned to ice. It actually kind of hurts your face as it's coming down now. So definitely some progress, if you will, from the rain we had earlier. But again, uh, the roads are clear for the most part. They're wet, of course. The wind has settled down some too, but when it does come in, it is pretty brutal. It really feels much colder once you get hit by that wind. You'll definitely want to find your hat somewhere in your coat closet this morning. Your gloves are recommended as well. Layers, a jacket, waterproof jacket preferably as you head out the door. Some rain boots as well, especially as the snow hasn't even started yet and we're already starting to see these conditions here. Now, snow in New England in October isn't really that uncommon. The last time we had it around Halloween time was October of 2011. Take a look at this video here. A major storm blanketed the Northeast. Rhode Island got just two to six inches, but parts of Connecticut and western Massachusetts got two to three feet of snow in some spots. I checked with Pete, and since the early 1900s, it has snowed 16 times in October in our area, but the average date for the first snowfall is December 2nd. Now, the last time we had measurable snow in this area this year was in April, mid-April, and this is video from Blackbird Farm in Smithfield. You may remember we were still in complete lockdown, so there weren't many cars on the roads. People were kind of hunkering down at home at the time. It's different now, and for people heading out, which we are seeing on this road in North Smithfield, you know, their conditions are fine driving. Ours were fine going in this morning, but as it turns into snow, you'll want to take it slow, of course. Always the first snowfall of the year, we're reminded of how to drive in the snow all over again. As New Englanders, we're used to it, of course, year after year, but it, it is a little bit of a, a, a moment to pause when you get in the car and it starts to snow and you head out on the road for the first time this year. So keep it slow. Take some extra time this morning getting ready to get all the gear you need for snowfall and make sure you stay warm. Live in North Smithfield, I'm Kate Walsh, 12 News.